<laughs> I keep fucking forgetting about that. <laughs> Something I have to fix. Hello, welcome in Pandora players. Don't forget to complete your daily login. First order of business, welcome new Pandora player, Rick Crow Van Crow. Hope you enjoy your follower emotes and have fun here on stream. They're a really chill dude. <laughs> I like I like his streams. <laughs> How am I doing today? I'm sleepy. I'm sleepy. I'm sorry guys. I'm still sleepy. Sleepy EP. A little tired. I'll probably be tired for a while. Just between like all the stress and stuff. I got like, I got off the PC early last night and then um, I did the cat food stuff on time. <laughs> so uh, I got to like actually have some rest and downtime. Thank God it's still EB, yeah, yeah. Uh, I do have some new news. Uh, there are some new Tangia interactions. I added some in. Uh, they added this thing in, so uh, I fixed it up and brought some back. <laughs> uh, so we'll see how that goes. Uh, again, the sound alerts, I think I'll get it done this weekend because tomorrow I want to do uh, prep for Power World and Baldur's Gate. And then um, just kind of relax some. <laughs> so sound alerts will be this weekend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sound alerts will probably be... Um, I'll probably make the sound alerts free. Aw! Thanks for the sub, Ruru! Aw! <laughs> Continuing your premium membership, I see how it is. Welcome in, uh, Molther. Oh yeah, hello, Thoughtbot. Hello, Crab. Hello, Ruru. Hello, Molther. How's everybody doing? How you doing? <laughs> but yeah, I think the, the sound alerts will probably be the free ones, and then I'll put paid, um sound bites on Tangia. Like the ones that either play really long or like the really annoying ones I don't want people to play a lot. <laughs> so uh, yeah, it'll be like that. And then that way I'll have more room, um, more room to do like um, other redeems and stuff. <laughs> My brain's dying, I'm so sorry. Like we just got in, I'm already dying. But yeah, Ruru, you were playing <laughs> No More Heroes last night, and I was like, oh my god, that shit's my jam. I can't believe how old- oh my god, how old is that game? That's the real question. I know it originally released on the Wii, because that's how I played it. If you guys don't know No More Heroes, it's a- it is a wild-ass fucking game. 2007? I'm old plus one. I don't. I don't think that's news. <laughs> Two thousand seven. What the fuck? It's like seventeen years old. What the fuck? Seven. I don't know how to do math, guys. Two twenty twenty four minus two thousand seven. That is something. Oh my god, I can do math, guys. I did math for once. Dude, if you don't know this game, it's... It's a game, alright. Get the fucking article open. You play as this dude called Travis Touchdown. And it came out for the Wii. So it had, of course, motion controls. And like... the So he has this... Um, It's like a beam katana. Essentially, you can see it here in the picture. Um, And... <laughs> The way you're supposed to charge it up <laughs> is you're supposed to make like a jerky motion like you're jerking off. <laughs> That's the intended way. I was doing that for a while and then I was like, um, I was like, uh, this is like hurting my arm. And so I just started wiggling it from side to side and it was faster. I was like, oh, hell yeah. <laughs> you know, I like my girls a bit older. Damn, Ruru. Oh my God. You trying to riz me? Oh my God. But yeah, I would just like, I was like, damn, how do you guys like jerk it? And I'm just like, ah, oh, I know, I know a better way. I'll just wiggle it back and forth really quickly. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, the music in that game is so good. You made me want to play it. And I'm like, oh, do I have to break out? Do I have to break out my Wii? My Wii 2, my Wii 2, hello? My Wii U is in the living room because I was playing, um, discovering the secret text terrified. <laughs> It was a little janky. 
Um, Reaper, Reaper, that's what people call me. Dude. <laughs> You had to play, okay, so when you played, you had to have the nunchuck too. And so you had to be like sweat slashing back and forth. It was it was really dumb. And I was watching Ru play and I was like, oh my god, how do, like they have you do okay, you know that thing that you're not supposed to do where you put your palm on the joystick and you rotate it really quickly because it'll like destroy your hand. You're not supposed to do that. And I was like, oh my god, I'd totally be like <laughs> I mean, doing it. What is it? Sciatica or whatever it's called. <laughs> what, you, what is that? Oh, does anyone know what I'm talking about? But no, I, I could get the Wii U and hook it up and play it. <laughs> I did that to Perry so hard. Yeah, exactly. I was like, it was like rotate R quickly. And I'm like, oh, bitch, I'd be palming that shit. <laughs> oh, like the controls seemed like it made sense. But at the same time, sometimes I was like, I know that's supposed to like how it's supposed to work in like the motion and it just like <laughs> came off like funky on the controls. But yeah, making me want to play this game. The music's good. I like some of the characters. Um, It's just it's a weird game, guys. That's all I can say. It's really fucking weird. If you want to watch Ruru play it, I highly suggest that. We get the shout out. There we go. Shout out to Ruru. I love his streams. Always a good time. Always a good time. <laughs> but yeah, I was like, oh my god, what a fucking like throwback. No more heroes. And then I never played the second or third ones. So if you play those two, man, I'll be there. <laughs> Although yesterday Twitch was like, for some reason, I was watching your stream and then like Twitch died on my PC and I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> and they came back on one browser, but not the other one. So I was like watching you on like three browsers on my phone. <laughs> so that's why I like kind of stopped replying. I was just like, ah, shit. <laughs> Fucking Twitch. It was like connection error. And I was like, what? Not stalking me at all? No, I wanted to watch. <laughs> maybe, maybe a little stalking. Maybe just a little bit. Maybe, maybe coming off is a little bit psycho for that. <laughs> but it wasn't working. And I asked Crab, I was like, is Twitch working for you? He's like, yeah. I was like, shit, because I couldn't even update my info. I was like updating my info in OBS for the next stream. Like the title, <laughs> my stupid title. I was like, ah, oh, I'm so smart for this. Trying to beat, beat the witch allegations and it wouldn't update. And I was like, huh? And I checked on down detector and it was this massive spike of Twitch down <laughs> things. I was like, oh, oh, <laughs> Twitch having a moment. I'll buy the sequels. Oh, man, only if you enjoy the first game, because I, I wouldn't want you to be like, oh, yeah, play them. I've never played them. I don't know if they're even good. Oh, I enjoy the first game, though. <laughs> I hope you enjoy the quirkiness of just everything about it. It was just like. Was it Suda, but Steam sale? Oh, you're right. I still haven't bought anything for the Steam sale. Let me check something. I know Suda51 did other games. Uh, let me check something. Goichi Suda. Okay, let's see. Oh my god, is this the dude who did... Killer is dead. No, wait. Wait, No More Heroes came out in 2021. Jesus Christ. That was sooner than that. Tra Travis strikes again. No More Heroes. What do you mean? 2019. Yeah, he did Killer is dead. Lollipop Chainsaw. Dude, Lollipop Chainsaw is getting a remake. That's insane. I did something else. Fatal Frame. God damn, Fatal Frame. Oh my God, he did. <laughs> she did report from hell. Oh my god, he did Michigan report for hell. Oh my god, silver the silver case. Yeah, I think I have the silver case. I haven't played it though. Dude, his games are fucking weird. I was thinking he did um something else, but I don't see it here. Who made that game then? 
me see. Ooh. Oh, Sue Hero. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was looking at. Sorry, you can't fucking see what I'm like looking at. <laughs> I was like, oh, it feels like deadly premonition, dude. But I'm like, I don't know. And I was wrong. Wait! Wait, both of them are working on this Hotel Barcelona? Artistic direction is so crazy different. Yo, yeah, yeah. Those are all him. Yeah, those were all him, dude. We just like fucking open wiki in another thing. <laughs> uh, Goichi. fucking hello. Yeah, yeah, here's the list. Wait, let me scroll back down. He did for ones that I know, like outright. He did the silver case, Michigan report from hell. I original plan and producer. He did killer seven. Um, no more heroes. Fatal Frame, The Mask of Lunar Eclipse, specifically that one. Over here is two desperate struggle. Wait, what is this one? Is this like a remake then? Travis Strikes Again, No More Heroes. Imported to Windows years later that year. Oh, so this is the one that's on. Uh, what is it? Shadows of the Damned. Lollipop Chainsaw. Dude, 2012. Holy shit. Killer is dead. Those are the ones that I specifically came in, but look, look, look. He had the original idea for this Hotel Barcelona. And then I go to uh, Hidetaka Suihiro, who did Deadly Premonition. And he's also working on Hotel Barcelona. Dude, two crazy, crazy idea dudes. Writer, director, dude. <laughs> Whatever this is, is gonna be insane. Besties, I wouldn't be surprised. They they both have the good life. They both have fucking I have. <laughs> I have this one. I have Deadly Premonition Origins. Oh, uh, and I, I haven't played two yet. I want to play. Oh, yeah. Fucking D4 Dark Dreams Don't Die. Oh. And they only ever did like the first arc or whatever of that. Oh. Wait, they did Tomba 2. Design. Oh, he's a designer for Tomba 2. I was like, wait a second, what? Spy fiction? Dude, <laughs> if you don't know Deadly Premonition, it is a fucking wild game. <laughs> and I'll probably play it at some point because it's just so fucking like weird. Dude, don't worry. Weird games are weird, and that's my that's like my jam. Fucking weird ass shit. Oh, uh, no. Okay, let me see. You won't be able to see it because I'm... Oh, I can look at it on Steam. No. Hello. 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 Give me a sec. Steam. Nerd! Nerd! I just like video games. <laughs> I like weird video games. Okay, so let's see. Uh, Hotel Bar... Barcelona. That's what it's called, right? Hotel Barcelona. Yeah, okay. Wait, what's this? Wait. Shut up. Oh, wait, I can... Wait, I have an idea. You're just gonna have to deal with the music overlapping. Wait, so it's like a, a side-scrolling hack and slash? Sorry. Hello! So like Metroidvania? Oh? I'm sorry, fucking what? Is that a giant chicken in a wheelchair? What the fuck? I mean, obviously you're seeing fucking... <laughs> Dude, need I say more weird shit? Yeah? What the fuck? Is that like their ultimate? What is this game? <laughs> Dude. I don't know what this is, but I kind of want to play it. <laughs> D 
Dude, what the fuck are these bosses? Oh my god. Hotel Barcelona coming 2024. Wait, 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 Shibari play? I'm sorry, excuse me? Excuse? <coughs> if you don't know who that is, God bless your soul. Uh, Justine is a novice federal marshal who is an insane serial, uh, who has an insane serial killer named Dr. Carnival living inside of her. I'm sorry, what? Will she be able to exterminate all the evil serial killers and escape from this cursed hotel? Find out in this 2.5D slasher film parody action game. Action roguelike Metroidvania roguevania PVE. Dude? <laughs> this looks fucking fun as hell. I'm adding that to my wish list. Barcelona. I can't fucking spell. Hotel Barcelona. Oh my god. Dude, I want to play that. <laughs> so basically, you have a serial killer inside of you. Looks like a classic Suda51 game. He wrote the concept for it. Yeah. Excuse me, why are you playing again? Yeah, so he wrote the uh, he has the original idea is suda 51 we were looking at suda 51 stuff because we were talking about no more heroes and then i went and i was like oh my god this i thought this one game was done by uh hidetaka sue hero and then i look and he's sue Sui hero is the writer and director of the same game and i was like oh my god <laughs> two crazy idea dudes coming together for a game sign me the fuck up dude Oh, this is the dude who did Dread Deadly Premonition. I love Deadly Premonition. Oh yeah, he did the missing, uh, this game too, that I heard was really good. Oh yeah. <laughs> Fucking crazy shit. Welcome in. Hello. <laughs> How you doing? Anyway, I'll move on. I'm sorry. I saw that and I was like, yo. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah, damn. Ah! I'm sorry. I have the background in VTube Studio is white, and it's so bright. Those are my my eyeballs. Oh, but yeah, yeah. <laughs> Do a vote. Should should I set up? Oh, one second. Hello. No, come on, please work with me. Okay, open flashbang. Yeah, it's okay, fucking my eyeballs. Okay, we'll do we'll do this. I better be muted. Okay, good. Hold on. New poll. No, we don't need to know who to marry. I already got married in Stardew Valley. <laughs> Uh, 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 we'll do like two minutes. Start pull. Oh my god, guys, should I play No More Heroes? It's not gonna be anytime soon, but like soonish. When does the Steam sales end? Watch it be like today, and I'm like, oh, I don't got no money for that. Bum, bum, bum. Hello, open fucking store, dude. Dude, how much are you going to fish? July 11th. Oh, that's in three days. Okay, I might wait three days. I might be able to buy stuff then. No, I don't want football 2024. The fuck? I think I would have to. I can't spell. Well, I've, I, I played it when it came out on the Wii. <laughs> uh, this isn't a new game to me. I've completed the game. 
back in 2007. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Oh, it's 10 bucks. Because I'm thinking if I played it on my Wii U, um, I'd probably punch the microphone and shit and make, like, a lot of noise. Because, <laughs> like, when I wave my hand like this, you guys can normally hear it if I'm, like, talking. Like, I was just waving my hand back and forth and by the mic. Uh, so I'd probably have to play it on controller, and that's going to be a whole ride in and of itself. But, uh, I'll add it to the cart. Wait. Wait, go back. How much is the other games? Also, I love how it's like, it's mixed. <laughs> no more here is three is 13. No more here is two is 10. Oh, uh, Travis, Travis strikes again. No more here is complete edition. What is this? I feel like this is a completely different game. Well, I'll play the original. And then... Mm, we'll see how it goes. Um, um. All the fish, all the fish. All right, you guys want me to play? We'll, we'll have that for a future thing. Let me close this fucking thing out. I don't need to stare at myself no more. But yeah. <laughs> god damn. Just god damn. The game's so old. All right, guys uh how about we get over to the game now i need to like open the game let's move over yeah i know i'm still in the middle of the screen don't worry about it hold on a sec i put myself like no not that not that small well ah, now i can't see what the fuck why is the game opening over here what the hell Bitch. Girl, it opened on the second screen. <laughs> what the fuck? Hold on, I gotta fix myself. Put my wings down. Uh me. Hello. Oh let, let me in. Let bitch. I think like here is good because the characters tend to be over a bit more. Can't hear the music, the, the sound, there we go. Okay, give me a second. All right, right, this is a keyboard game. I can't hold my controller. I don't need to see the cinematic. We've seen it. We've seen it. This is part two. So what happened last time is we ended on, we just got the shoes and danced our way into uh, the town. And they were like, yo, you witch. And we were like, oh shit. Am I not hitting? No. This one. Load the save. Yes, 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 yes. No control for you. I mean, I could have my controller out. But I'm not using a controller, so it seems kind of dumb. All right. Task available. Cool. All right, what's up? Oh, Elise, you scared me stiff earlier. I did? It takes a great deal of courage to put those two in their place. You did well, Elise. They're the ones being unreasonable. Uh, Miss Mahilda. Matilda. I can't fucking read, guys. I'll be babbling on and on about it in church, I'd wager. 
You say they'll be wanting, uh, would you say they'll be wanting a word with me, uh, Mrs. Matilda? They might, but you have nothing to fret about, at least. I can assure you, not one soul in Kieferberg thinks ill of you, my dear. Thank you, Mrs. Matilda. Besides, the townsfolk are still shaken by that windstorm. I'd say they'll forget about you, uh, all about you and your shoes by at the afternoon. Well, I wouldn't be so certain. If you say so, but I really don't think so. Look, Mama, they're so shiny. You stole those, at least. Be honest. <laughs> I didn't steal them, you. Settle down now, you two. More importantly, are you all right, my dear? Ah, uh, about earlier. I... There's no need to hold your tongue, Elise. What type of game is this? It's a horror adventure. Horror RPG. Yeah. Chan's folk made too much of it, and that wasn't remotely acceptable. Everyone knows old Johan's lost his wits. Don't you start, Apple. Oh, Mama, can I get shoes like that too? You have ugly ogre feet, Grune. Mama, Apple's being mean again. Can't you two see I'm trying to talk to Elise? I'm all right, Mrs. Elizabeth. Thank you. You can catch up later, Elise. I'd best go. Horror, my favorite, yeah. <laughs> I'd have a good word with Eugene. My goats aren't doing too good. Oh, graffiti! Oh, graffiti! Apple! Goddamn. Yo, did she just did a little spin? But yeah, yeah, so we're... Uh, we got our little goody two-shoes. We dug them out of the garden. <laughs> ah, there you are, Elise. Old Johan truly went too far. I suppose there's no need to hold your tongue, lass. That was far from reasonable. Nobody agrees with him. I suppose there comes a time when older folks lose their minds. Well, that's a different story, Mariel. I wouldn't say... There is no story, Ludwig. At least with singing and dancing, so what? Truly, old Johan's outburst was rather distasteful. But I have been meaning to ask where you got those shoes, Elise. Oh, there. You don't have to tell us, Elise. You're right about what uh, you're right about what you said. We all should be treating you with a little more respect. Oh, but I'm awfully curious. Well, maybe you shouldn't treat me like shit then. Yo, a duck. Yeah, I didn't know I could go back here. All right, this was blocked off before because of the windstorm. I'm kind of dog. Yo! Oh, that's a Burke. I don't want to do work yet. I have to go talk to people. What the fuck is all the way back here? What the fuck? Yo! What is this? Oh shit, that's a fairy circle if I've ever seen one. Spent plenty of time repairing the stable's roof, that's for certain. Hard at work, are you, Elise? As always, Mr. Heinrich. You've heard about Eugene's horses, then? Folks are more interested in what happened this morning, Heinrich. What about your horses, Mr. Eugene? I'm getting a couple new ones is all nothing of great importance. But what the fuck happened to the other ones? I wouldn't put it like that, lad. Horsepower is essential in your business, isn't it? Merchants can't lift a finger without their horses. That's great news, Mr. Eugene. For Kieferberg, too. I'll be lending a hand with preparations. What? One second. Can we get, like... Yeah, I think that's better. Alright. We lend a hand with preparations. Full of promise, aren't we? If you say so, sirs. So I got like a stable out here. Yo, it's a whole ass farm. Oh my god. Wait, who's this? Taking those shoes for a ride about town, are you, Elise? That's right, Mr. Wilhelm. Say your uh, just say your piece. Nothing of the sort, lass. In fact, it's a joy seeing some cheer back in Kieferberg. Is that so? Old Johan doesn't know what he's saying, Elise. Huh? It's the small things in life, you see. A shiny new pair of shoes, a new hat, even a pair of socks. I suppose. Make the most of what brings you joy, Elise. You will be much happier that way. Also, I don't know what accent I'm doing, but that's the accent of the town and I'm sticking with it. 
<laughs> they all have the same kind of accent. I don't know. No windmill? Ooh, what's this? Toy horse. Okay. Item. Get. What's this? Uh, if it wasn't for Granny Gretel, I'd have to make my own bread every day. Workbench sits outside, typically used by the townsfolk of Kieferberg to bag newly milled flour. Whatever floats your boat, yeah. It's locked, I suppose. It's not like I, uh, like I make my own bread. I don't need to get in here. Yeah, it's literally a mill, a wind mill. Ah, uh, ha. Uh, anyway, <laughs> I'm sorry. That wasn't even like a joke. That's literally what it is. It's a mill that uses wind to work. Oh, I'm so smart. I'm gonna skadoodles around and see what's up. Oh, we're like in this part of town. Okay, okay. Oh, they took the maple down. Ah, oh, if it isn't last in the moment. Tell us all about those shoes, why don't you? What about them, Mrs. Wilma? What about them, she says. Out with it last, we're, we're losing our minds here. They're Granny Holly's. Found them under Granny Holly's bed this morning. It seems they're a gift she intended to give me, but... Can't say I'm too convinced at least. What? There's no way old Holly would have uh, could have afforded those. You, on the other hand, I wasn't aware you had the means at least. And I don't. As you know, I'm living paycheck to paycheck, peer ladies. Why? But neither did old Holly. So you mean to say you found them under her bed? That is what I said, Mrs. Elma. Old Holly was full of surprises, that's true. How could we forget about the day she brought Elise to Geiferberg? Oh, Lord knows what else that old lass was hiding, huh? Hell yes, bitch, you down! How dare you say that I'm fucking suspicious? Was it this one? Oh, hell yeah, we're out of su suspicion. These are, these are un- uh, not colored in ones. You are the portraits back to normal. These are our girlies that we can date by the day way. We can date Rosin Marine, Freya, or Lebguhen. Sus, I'm not sus anymore. I got the sus out of me. They call me a witch for fucking nothing. I'm not a witch. I'm just a gal. Ooh, this is pretty. Yo, a little fountain thing. How many afternoons did I spend here washing these folks' clothes, I wonder? Gufferberg's washi uh, washing well, a statue of fish sta uh, stands in its center. Oh, I thought it was like... Oh, so this is where they wash their clothes. Oh, okay. Um, Mrs. Wilma's got a whole shed for herself, and yet... Fashioned out of an old barrel, rickety cart, rest, uh, cradling a couple worn-out buckets. Oh, damn. We've got clotheslines and stuff. Okay. Okay, okay. These were all uh, blocked off before because of the windstorm, so I haven't actually, like, seen those areas. Seen Demarius? Right. I kind of want to talk to this lady, but I don't think I can. Because they'll give me work and I don't want to- Yo! Daytime? <gasps> we can go on a date with Freya? Hell yeah. My Elise, look at those shoes. Red truly does look best on you, Elise. Why, thank you. No, but you have to wear them to the festival, Elise. Now's the time to find yourself a proper suitor, Elise. Ah, uh, that's precisely what we were chatting about with Freya. Oh, yes. Aren't I a little too young to be looking for a husband? Why, the sooner the better, I'd say. It's not exactly what I'd like to be doing with my time, if I'm to be honest. I used to feel the same way until I met Finn. You'll see. I'd say Freya's got a good chance of meeting her future husband soon. Oh, Mrs. Brunhilde, I wouldn't say I'm... You're quite the catch, isn't she, Dorothea? Oh, Freya is the catch. Ah, uh, in truth, I... I do feel the same as Elise. My interests lie elsewhere, you see. No, oh, you don't mean. Sewing! And I have my hands full with the festival, too. This isn't the time. No, oh, that reminds me. Uh, would you come and meet me by the well at dusk, Elise? Oh, uh, yes, I suppose. Girls these days, huh? You two will come around, I'm certain. Alright, so the date is um by the well at dusk, so the well is over there. At least I'm pretty sure that's the, where she's talking about. I'm gonna go back here. Oh shit, where the fuck are we? Oh, it's just this area. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
and go back down. Yeah, 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 yeah. Where the fuck am I? Girl. Whirl? I gotta run around. But yeah, we've seen like two horror moments and um... Jesus Christ. Got my um, boots scared off of me. Instantly lost. I'm not lost. Fuck, I knew where I was going. I just didn't know there was a wall there. <laughs> All right, we gotta talk to uh, father. Yo, a day with Lebkuhen available? Let's see, what time? I'm here for my earful, I suppose. You're no child, Elise. For goodness sake. I'll spare you, Elise. You're aware you've said too much. Couldn't have stayed silent, you know that. I agree it was their fault, their fault Elise, but you both know this will only get you the wrong kind of attention. Old Johans, to be exact. I'm well aware, Lebkuhen. There's no real need for you to fret over this, you know? There is the utmost need for me to fret over, at least. I'll keep Father Hans from dwelling on it too much. All right. Why don't you meet here? Uh, meet me here at dusk, at least. We could both use a little downtime, wouldn't you say? Oh, I gotta pick? I gotta pick one of the dates? God damn it. I'll be here. I should probably go on the date with the other girl because, um... I don't have a heart with her yet. All right, what are these two old fogies fucking talking about? Not so certain I want to talk to these two. I'm hoping you've had some time to think, Elise. Guyverberg needs order and fellowship, Hans. He needs stability. You can't keep going like this. Going like what? You're well aware of what I'm talking about, lass. Let's keep our cool, old Johan. Elise has spared it some thought, I'm certain. Let's say I have. You ought to listen to your elders, lass. This can't be good. I didn't like that conversation one bit. I mean, hey, I can't. Okay, I didn't actually mean to like tell them off earlier. <laughs> that was actually a mistake. Uh, I picked the wrong answer. But um, also, old Johan can like fuck off for all I care. The fragrant mountain breeze frolics about the rolling hills, spreading its spring cheer all across Kieferberg. This game is so fucking pretty. They did a really, really good job with it. Okay, so, um, I guess we're not having dates right now, unless I have to go back and have a date with, um, Rosin Marine, but I don't think I do. So, let me go up here. really does look good. Yeah, it's so freaking pretty. All right. Um, oh, there's people talking here. What's what's up? All right, Dad, work in those shoes, are you? They hardly make a difference, Mr. Guido. Come now, lads. We ought to have a good logging camp. Getting that maypole done in one day won't be an easy task. I must say I'm not confident either. All we need is a little cheer, lad, and get the townsfolk feeling jolly again. There's no shortage of joy in, his, in this last, that's for certain. We all saw you twirling about the village square, Elise. Never imagined you could sing. Oh, that wasn't... Way to keep up the cheerful mood, loss. It's precisely why Kieferberg needs most this week. I suppose... Keep that in mind, Elise. You must share more of what uh, that song and dance you hear. Did the maypole get destroyed? No. I thought it was up, but maybe they hadn't put it up yet? Oh no, here's this fucking bitch. What did you want? Wait, come back here. Fucking spying asshole. Silly old thing. To think that Loop Guhen. Loop Guhen and I used to spend entire afternoons taking turns on the swing. Secured by slightly frayed rope and cutter covered in pine needles, those swings, wooden planks, weighs gently in the breeze. I meant to talk to this bitch. Oh, I guess I can't. Because I already talked to her. Alright, do we have any money? I don't think we got money. Lads, I think I'm broke as fuck. Yep, I'm <laughs> too broke for this shit. Always lovely seeing you, Elise. All right, um, see ya. You have to look after yourself, Elise. Listen, I know that we're in like Germany, but um, the accent came out and it's just gonna be this accent for this. It's just like an Irish type accent. I don't fucking know. Okay, so we went in this cave thing. I wonder if there's something up in that old windmill. I don't know what it was about or what that thing was, but when I, uh, what I saw in there was a ritual of sorts. There's no doubt about it. 
Yeah, so we have to keep our sanity up so we don't go literally insane, dude. Okay, don't go that way. Okay, cool. <laughs> Rip broke boy hours. Yeah, that's like an understatement. We're broke as fuck, dude. Got no money. No money! No, no, no. You gotta hop, skip, girl. Hop, skip, jump. Only six thanks to your name. You mean Franks? Franks? <laughs> I think it's Franks. Yeah, I was like, what? So I'm supposed to move this. The windmill that once was. This is it, surely, but I can't move this out of the way. Maybe I should come back some other day. Hey, welcome in, Kiri. All right, so we have to wait until this fucking thing moves or we get the strength to move it. Uh, let's go check in on Rosin Marine. So the other two girls dates are at dusk. The perspective grapes that I love to think are actually just giant grapes. I feel like I like hurt my finger. Eh, I don't know how. Oh, here she is. She'll tell us her date time. Okay, what date time do you got, girl? Uh, Elise, I thought you'd be in town. And I was. Did something happen, Elise? The old fools made a tremendous fuss over my shoes. A fuss? What do you mean? They accused me of being a witch right in front of everyone. All because I sang and danced my way to Kieferberg. Oh, I'll show them how wicked I can be. Elise, I'm losing my wits in this town, Rosmarine. There was that old hag, too, and I... I can't wrap my head around it, Rosmarine. I truly can't. An old hag? I'll tell you about it later. I... I'd best head back to work. Say, Elise, uh, won't you meet me here at dusk? I can try, I suppose. I'll make you something hearty for supper, Elise. Some eggs. All the eggs you can get me. Hmm. Okay, so all their dates are at dusk. I'm gonna have to, like, pick one. Oh, uh, no, no, not the tutorials. I forgot about that. All right, well, I do need to make money because I have to pay off that fucking miffy bitch asshole. I don't spell too good. Yeah, I I kind of got it in the end. Egg. Egg. I got it in the end. I was like, thanks. I was like, oh, you're not trying to say thanks, funny. And you're talking about money, so it must be Frank's. <laughs> hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. I got it in the end, it's fine. And you did too, yeah! All right, so we gotta get some jobs. And then at dusk, where are we gonna go on a date with? That's the real question. Let's see, who, who, what job do we wanna do? So there's the old lady up there. Oh, uh, and then there's two jobs over here. Let's see what the jobs over here are first. Because they're in the same area. Okay, so there's this job. Elise! Mama won't let me chop wood for her. Don't be silly, Jacob. You're much too young to handle a hatchet. <laughs> I, like I said, most of my friends can't fucking spell, so I'm just kind of used to it. I can't even fucking spell. Dyslexic game, right? Let's rise up. Uh, can you get some wood for the hearth, Elise? Um, I'm afraid not. Maybe I can make some time later, Miss Linda. That's all right, Elise. Let me know if you change your mind. That means I can do it for you, Mama. No means no, Jacob. Good grief. Okay, so chop wood. That was quite the show there, lassie. Come now, Lorelei. I need Elise to uh, lend me a hand. What is it, Mrs. Marlin? I was hoping you'd pick some apples today, Elise. Um... Do we, do we want to pick apples? Um, oh, I didn't read the rest of that. Do you want to pick apples, chop wood, or whatever the other old lady has to do? Has for us to do. Go up this way. All right, what you got? Girl, what you got? I don't even remember who used to live here. It's Cozy Nook. Okay, well, I was trying to talk to the lady. 
Like lady? Hello? Oh, how dreadful! Look what that windstorm did to our poor alleys. Did away with a few things, I see. Make too little of it, Elise. I don't know well, what else there is to say about the windstorm, Mrs. Odley. Uh, Odley? Uh, most of the townsfolk have already put it behind them, so why can't you? Old Johan just as concerned as I am lost, for good reason. Oh, here we go again with old Johan. Oh, that reminds me! I can assure you, Miss Odley. Odley uh... I say Odley or Odley? I think it's Odley. These shoes aren't... Old Wilhelm's making a rosary for my precious granddaughter, Griselda, you see. Won't you please go see if it's uh, uh, ready for me, Elise? I suppose... Oh, so it's like a fetch quest, it's not like a time one? I don't even know who the fuck she's talking about. Yo, who? Who's making a thing? She said it and I already forgot. <laughs> Instant forgetfulness! Ah, whatever, let's do a job. I think I'm gonna do the old Johan. No. It definitely wasn't him. She said someone else. Oh, uh, we're gonna do chop wood. I'll be heading off then. I'll go with you, Elise. Oh, no, you won't, Jacob. Well, Mama. Why don't they ask Freya to chop it for them instead? Chop, chop, chop. Oh, God. Yeah, let's start. So what do I do? E chop or kick. Okay. So chop kick, chop kick, chop kick, yeah? Two. One. Oh, arc. Would help if I used the other thing. Wait, what the fuck? We kicked an anvil? Stop putting chickens down! What the fuck, dude? Hold on, I can only do so much! Stop having so much fucking chickens! Oh, let go ahead, stop! Shit! Round two, okay, let's go. Does it give me like a second chance to make more points because there's a no fucking way my dumb brain can handle this? Wait, did we do them all? Score! 47! Rank! A! A! Not bad! Not, not the worst or whatever, but hey. Please pay me good. Try again? No, fuck. I'm not doing better than that. <laughs> Oh, I knew I could rely on you, Elise. That's a lot of logs. Here you go, my dear. Thank you, Mrs. Linda. How much money did we get? I already forgot. We're like midday now. Hell yeah. I thought I'd never find you, Elise. Oh, what now, Miffy? It's your- Anyway- I don't have any food for- I don't have food for you. Shoo, shoo! Uh, but, but, but at is your- My what? Your friend! <laughs> what? Yippee! The last with the funny hat, she's right outside! <laughs> huh? Yippee! Wait, you meet you! The fucking sprite, though? Aw, uh, okay, wait, I'm gonna have to do something. Actually, never mind, I think I'm fine. Where am I? Take me to her, Molly, right now! What do you mean she's right outside? What the fuck? Why 
is she in town? She said she won't get me in town. My, you're covered in dirt, lass. Uh, I'm... She's so funny looking. Look at her silly hat. Angelica, don't be rude. Do you know this lass, Lizbeth? Oh, he no. said she's from Primmeldorf. Oh. oh, I'm not from Primmeldorf. I've never had a... Why? I haven't the faintest idea, Ariane. Oh, uh, I'm looking for Elise. Have you seen her? Elise, do you know her? You do happen to know Elise, but how do you know her, lass? Uh, Elise said she's adopted. How did you hear about this, Melly? Oh, if you please tell me where to... Look, Mama, she has a tiny scarecrow. Oh, uh, forgive me, but does anyone know where I can find Elise? No, oh, shit, there she is. Marine. Yeah. Sake. What are you doing here, you? So you do know the last Elise? Ah, <laughs> uh, yes, she's. Keep it together, Elise. Think, Elise. Think. <laughs> A distant cousin from Grimmeldorf. Why you don't have cousins, Elise? I do recall old Holly's mother had a sister, but I never met her. Yes, exactly. Rosmarine's here is my aunt's granddaughter. Ah, uh, it's Rosmarine. Oh, I'm so very pleased to meet you, Rosmarine. Oh, th thank you. <laughs> this is how all unprompted social interactions feel. <laughs> a little. Anyhow, it's getting quite late. We best move along before. Oh, but do tell me, my dear. You know you had a cousin. Um, Granny Holly told me about her. She said Mars and Mar Rosmarine here might show up one day. You see, never got to meet my aunt before she passed, but I'm glad I got to meet my cousin. Ah, oh, I see, I see. She turned up just in time for the festival too. Mama, Mama, can the funny lady come play with us? Uh, of course. I wouldn't mind. Wouldn't want to bother you, Rosmarine. You're all very welcoming, but we ought to move along and... What wonders, Elise? How did you meet your cousin, then? And are all alone at the crosswords. Um, she sent someone to Kieferberg. <laughs> oh, Rosmarine asked someone from Primmeldorf to ask around Ki uh, Kieferberg, you see? Oh, I see. I can't say I remember anything of the sort. Surprised such a thing didn't make itself known about town. Uh, you see, we... Oh, perhaps we're being rude, Aryan. I must say, I'm curious too. Well, I'd love to sit and chat, but we don't have the time. I'm sorry. Uh, of course, we, uh, we had to sweep the living room. You're a terrible liar, Rosmarine! You're terrible at this, Rosmarine! <laughs> it's truly a pleasure to meet you all. Let's go, Rosmarine! Oh, I got the suspicion up! God damn it, Rosemary, I just got the suspicion down! Girl! Hey, Kitoffles! Hi! This is brilliant. Aw, oh, we're just we're just having a little struggle. I just just a, just a little struggle. I'm doing good! How are you, girl? <laughs> you know what I like shouted at giving myself that. <laughs> So accessible. <laughs> oh, sorry, drinking. I gotta stay hydrated. Y'all need to stay hydrated too. I'm really good. Thank you. It's good to hear. Shit, girl. What the fuck are you doing here? Have you completely lost your rit wits, Rosmarine? I'm sorry, Elise. I knew you had a bird's nest for a brain, but this is too much. Uh, well, you know what you did. I I'm sorry, Elise. I didn't mean to. I was chasing after Flock, you see. For goodness sake. 
sake. For goodness sake, Rosmarine. Why not let him frolic about? What's go- Oh, uh, that's what goats do. But, uh, he took the laundry I was tending to right on my hands. I couldn't let him ruin your sheets. All right, well... Truth is, we made a complete mess of it. I don't even want to think about Father Hans's reaction. This is my new model. Yes, it is. Why doesn't she go to town? Because uh, she's not from town. She showed up literally randomly the night of the windstorm. <laughs> Looks so cool. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. Oop. Let me do something real quick. Kind of like in the way of the portrait still. Ugh. I put myself here and then I do black magic thing yeah yeah I have a new name and I have a new model and new lore and everything okay and record position and then I go here oh we don't have enough space well Oh, don't pin. Unpin. Copy. Paste. Bump, bump, bump. Yeah, I saw you go live and I was like, oh, wait, I don't recognize this name. And I was like, I know this voice. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I changed uh, for my. Um... I just mute myself. There we go. Oh. Please program, just fucking disconnect, why don't you? <laughs> this is, yes, this is me. Hi, here I am. I'm now an angel. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Put my wings up. Ha ah, ha, there we go. Everything's so cute. Oh, thank you, yeah. So now I'm Rosa Pandora. I'm, oh, I'll have it look here. I'm a eight star gotcha character in the game, Pandora's Wish. Yeah, I needed a name that people could easily pronounce because nobody could really pronounce my last name. And a lot of people called me Rosalina for no reason. And I was like, I don't have an, it, it was Rosalyn. I don't have an A, a there. <laughs> they were just like, Rosalina. And I'm like, what the fuck is that? So now we have this. But yeah, um, I was a demon. I was from a different dimension. The universe said, no, you're not allowed to be here. And so the universe deleted me and put me in a video game, a gotcha game to be specific. And now you're all my Pandora players. I'm mean, if you heard me burp just now, I'm sorry. <laughs> Banished, yeah, I got fucking destroyed, dude. But yeah, I can do great things, like I can lean forward now. Hi! <laughs> I can stick out my tongue. Uh, um, uh. <laughs> Two rebrands in one year? I mean, what? Well, well, three rebrands. Three, three rebrands. <laughs> Actually. In my one year, I had the original model, which was the red demon. And then I had the purple model. And then the pink cat. And then we're at this one. Yeah. The first two were pre made models, though. But, um, I'm a lot happier not being a demon anymore. Going for a new record? No, girl, I, no. Girl, I got an oil daddy? No. <laughs> no, no. A lot of the models I have are just, uh, pre made. Who made this one for you? Okay, so it was, uh, let me get the linky link. So, my, they, uh, Denshi Rendi. They designed this model, they drew it, and they rigged it. You didn't copy the period. And you can check them out here. They did a really, really good job. Uh, basically, I saw the model uh, as it was like partially done. Like they had just like rigged like the face. And I was like, oh my God, I love it. And so I messaged them like, can I buy? And they go, yeah, you pay up front. And I was like, understood. 
And they told me they wanted to have, they wanted to add like a, type to the fucking chat. Move out. They wanted to have a microphone, so I have a microphone. Although, um, I don't know why the voice part isn't working. I had it working before and now it's not working. Like the microphone thing in VTS Studio isn't working. So I got my microphone. I may sing. I might add a thing where I sing a really shitty song <laughs> for really expensive point redeem, but um, I don't know. That's for the future. And they were like, oh, I wanted to have a lot of expression, so I have a bunch of hands. They added, they were like, I'm gonna have a controller. I was like, yippee! And then we, of course, have like the facial, wait. We have the facial expressions. I I did some commissions of them too. The hands are so cool. I'm like, yeah. So we have, of course, we have the blush, the scared, <gasps> the crying, um, <laughs> no highlights, heart eyes, <laughs> the guru guru, dizzy like, oh my god, starry eyes, which I can use in conjunction with this. I can't really see it. I have stars. <laughs> That's like a completely separate thing though. <laughs> and then we have the dark, dark shadow. And the piano. Why are you so mean to me? <laughs> and uh, the things that I had commissioned was this one. I commissioned the lean in. I commissioned the jacket off and uh, the tongue out. Uh. And then I commissioned uh, to have my wings down because when I'm playing a game, the wings can kind of get in the way. So I commissioned that as well. Oh, and it, they gave me glasses too. Glasses. I can take the hail off. Boom. <laughs> For anyone who wasn't here, that's basically it. Yeah. I do plan to do more uh, commissions for the model in the future. So there will be more stuff. I, uh, things I really wanna do is have like one or two alternate hairstyles. So I wanna have like a short hairstyle and then probably like a ponytail. Uh, Cause I really like ponytails. I think they look really good. <laughs> and then um, I'm considering for much, much further down the line, uh, like animal ears and a tail. But that's like way, way out there. And then potentially in the far, far future, like a different outfit, but that's expensive and not really. <laughs> these these commissions are more like, ah, uh, it'd be great if I could, but I'd have to get like assets and stuff made for the stream first. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm just super happy. I finally got to like show off the model and stuff. Because it was important to me. I was going to wait until January to do it. And then I was like, well, if I'm going to change my name for my anniversary anyway, I might as well just use the model. <laughs> it's so freeing. Anyway, let's get back to the game. <laughs> I'm sorry, Elise. I didn't mean to trouble you. Ah, oh, forget it, Rosmarine. It's all right. I'm telling you, it's fine, Rosmarine. I feel all I've done so far is trouble you, which isn't a complete lie now, is it? Yet I do enjoy your company, so... Elise. Elise. Anyhow, we ought to keep our story straight. Maybe if we tell them I came to lend you a hand with hi uh, with work? This is it. That's it, Rosmarine! Huh? Alright, all right, listen carefully. Yes, yes. My last model only I could use and this model only I can use. I haven't used pre-made models uh, for stream since January 7th. Yeah. Yeah, no, I'm not going back to a pre-made model. I'm using pay to use assets like the background anyone can use, but that's like very, that's like, oh, oh no. I'm like that stuff anyone can use, but um, like I did, I got like a stinger and a logo and stuff so far. I commissioned custom emotes and those will come eventually, which was more important to me than anything else right now. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, yeah. 
I'm, I'm just so happy. Yeah! <laughs> Your grandmother is uh, Granny Holly's auntie. The one who never came to visit. That makes you my distant cousin of sorts, you see? Oh wait, but I'm reading the wrong thing. Uh, Granny Holly's auntie, see, I'm reading with the wrong voice, sorry. Very excited to see the new emotes. Yeah, that's like months away. <laughs> they were like, um, the artist was like, um, you you requested a lot of emotes and I was like, yes. <laughs> they are like, it's gonna take months. And I was like, I understand. And they were like, it's, it's expensive. And I'm like, yes, I know, I'll pay. <laughs> Yes, your Pandora players, your players for a Pandora's Wish, which is the game I'm trapped in. <laughs> My goal is to uh, get as many people to register for Pandora's Wish as possible. <laughs> Shut up and take my money. <laughs> Ugh. That's stretch. Well, at the very least, uh, it will be good quality. Yes, yes, it won't be like a uh, your char character here one. Because like, I was looking at those, I was trying to find a new artist. And I did a lot of searching, I flipped through a bunch of them, and I found one that I think uh, I liked their art style and I felt it fit the model well. Um, excuse me? Holy shit. So yeah, I'm, I'm super excited. That's what, um, that's what I used all my, not all of it, but that's what I'm using uh, a good chunk of my earnings from the last year for, is I saved up all my money and then, um, I'm using it now. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. All right, um, that makes me your distant cousin of sorts, you see? I don't know where the fuck am I clicked in. Yes, you came about to meet me, but we could have simply, uh, we could have simply bumped into each other and you asked me if I knew anyone named Holly. I'm sorry, I... I don't understand, Elise. How does that relate to what I said? Why? You liked Kieferberg so much you want to stay and lend a hand. Oh! Your kind, charitable, loving soul who wants to help with the festival. Ah, oh, thanks for the head pats. <laughs> uh, that'll keep them asking way too many questions. Uh, asking too- That'll keep them from asking too many questions, I wager. Guys, I can't read. <laughs> I think that's a great idea, Elise. Right. That being said, Rosmarine, you're going home right after nightfall, you hear? I don't want you hanging about these, uh, hanging about these folks too I much. I your angle, boy, <laughs> you are a devil. Listen. <laughs> Not the fucking cursed meme. It's back. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> it never stops being funny, dude. <laughs> <gasps> All right, Elise. I did it. We're making it happen right now. Then let's go. Yes. yes. Oh hell yeah. Yo, we can talk to our party. We must be careful, Rosmarine. These folks are all nosy and ill-tempered. We don't want to make this situation any worse. Understood? Yes, Elise. I'll be good. You see. You'll see. Oh my god, she disintegrated. Nah, she joined us! She's in the party. Head back to work. Yo, you think she can help me with work? Oh my, wait. She did say she was gonna help me with work. Okay, what's up? Well, surprises today, aren't you, Elise? My, who's this lass? I'd like to introduce you to my cousin from Primbledorf. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Baraz and Marine. You don't mean to tell me, uh, Holly still has family in Primbledorf. She did, but I wouldn't want to speak on Rosmarine's behalf, but uh, my granny has already passed, so I see. That's rather, that's rather unfortunate. You're from in a humble home, I can see that much. Oh, truly, I've been always been rather. Why aren't we all from a humble homes, Mrs. Bertha? Truly, Bertha, we hardly know the lass. My, people take offense to everything these days. We could also just not be a bitch. <laughs> She just like took one look at her and she's like, you fucking poor, ain't ya? <laughs> like, what the fuck? <laughs> okay, we don't have suspicion anymore. Thank God, these suspicious ass folks. I need to eat. Um, wait, no here, bread. Consume the bread. I have to go buy more bread. 
Why is everybody a bitch in this place? Because it's a small town. <laughs> it's a small town where everybody knows each other and they're nosy as fuck and they're assholes. All right, all right, Granny, I'm coming back for some food. I'm stuck. It's a fucking cat. Oh, that explains it, yeah. <laughs> what can I get for you today, dearie? Okay, I'm buying. Um, yo, we can get Labguhan. A bundle of cookies made with uh, different doughs, fillings, and toppings. Plus three. <gasps> Plus three? Oh, it's 30. What the fuck? Honestly, I should probably buy pretzels, because if I'm going to be having... Oh, shit, wait. Wait, they're 12 each? Come on, I'll buy two. Anything else? Some pretzels, maybe? Nope. Uh, see ya. Y'all to eat more, at least eat up? Well, no, Granny, I'm fucking broke. I need to save some of my money for later. Especially if I have to buy that stupid bitch food to make her show. Well, no, I don't need to pay her no more. I don't need to pay her in food no more because everybody knows Roz and Marine now. Ha 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 Fuck you, Molly. So this is your cousin, Elise. Uh, it's a pleasure to meet you, Empress and Marine. We're discussing the flower crowns for the festival, Elise. Ought to make one for Raza and Marine, too. Oh, I wouldn't want to trouble you. Don't be silly, Raz Marine. We want you to feel welcome. Be done with that scruffy hat of yours, too. I was surprised to hear you had a cousin, cousin Elise. Linda and Elizabeth told me uh, everything just now. Still don't quite understand how she came to be in Kieferberg, however... Ah, uh, you see! I've always known... Uh, I've always known I had an auntie named Holly in Kieferberg. I heard of the festival and decided to take my chances all. Ma, oh, that truly is wonderful, lass. Oh, but wasn't old Holly... No, would you look at the time? We're so busy! Oh, do enjoy the festival, dearie! Thank you! We're saved! Good thinking, Rosmarine! Thank God! She's smart! <laughs> Woo! Guys, which girl should we go on a date with? Maybe we can clean up with them. Oh, look, it's Freya. Goodness gracious, Elise. There's no need to make such a fuss, Freya. Oh, it's such a pleasure to meet you. My name is Freya. I'm a friend of Elise's here in Kieferberg. Oh, I'm, um, R Roz and Marine! What a wonderful name, Rosin Mar Marine. Oh my god, I can't fucking speak. It's nice meeting you, Freya. She's my cousin, Freya, from Primmeldorf. From Primmeldorf? Oh, you simply must come and dance with us. Ah, oh, of course, Freya. Everyone keeps talking about this festival. I'm very much looking forward to it. There's so much to show you, I can't wait. Oh, I know. Why don't you two come have dinner tonight? Tonight won't work, Freya. She's lending me a hand at home tidying up Granny Holly's old bits and pieces. Oh, that's quite all right. It's such a shame, though. I very much appreciate the invitation, Freya. Of course. Uh, you're welcome any time. Tell me if you need anything, both of you. Don't work yourself into the ground now. You too, Elise. All right, that's our other potential girlfriend. This is her dad, I think. Gustav. Oh, he's talking to this old asshole again. Now that's a face we've not seen before. Ah, uh, Mr. Gustav, this is my cousin, Ross Marine. It, it's Ross and Marine. A cousin! I had no idea you had family besides old Holly, Elise. I do recall old Holly had an aunt someplace near Primmeldorf. Welcome to Kieferberg, lass. I do hope you stay for the festival. Ah, uh, yes, I will. I must say I'm rather taken aback, Elise. Um... As if I'd even, uh, it's it's not much of a surprise, is it? Rosmarine came to meet me after her grandmother passed, that's all. This lass is right, there's no reason to fret. Uh, of course I wouldn't want to make anyone feel. On the contrary, Rosmarine, it's the other way around, if anything. I'm certain you'll enjoy your stay, lass. Thank you so much. Yeah, fuck you, you old Johan. Fucking asshole. I oh, talk to people because I'm always there. Must be time <laughs> to hydrate. God damn, what the fuck? Why did I choose the same one? By the way, it's randomized. <laughs> There's more lines, but yes, I'll hydrate.
I'm so fucking thirsty, guys. I'm dying. It's like also like insanely hot here. <laughs> I like let the dogs out and I was like, <laughs> insanely humid, really hot. It's such a jump scare, dude. It's a jump scare for me too. I have to hear my own voice like that. Like what the fuck? <laughs> but I thought it'd be funny. Ugh. Fucking Freddy. Dude, imagine Freddy being this game. He just like crawls out of that cave on all fours. <laughs> Are you talking to this lady? My Elise, who's this last? This is my cousin Ross Marine. Ross and Marine? Oh, I could have sworn it was just you and old Holly. She's always said I had an auntie in Primaldor for Rosamarines. Yo, we said her name right for once. Rosamarines, that auntie's granddaughter. Welcome to Kaiferberg, Rosamarine. You must, you simply must stay for the festival. Of course. Oh, I'd best gather the laddies for class now. You're a teacher, Mrs. Dorothea? No, I teach them some basic reading, writing, and numbers is all. All right, Mrs. Dorothea, we'll be on our way now. It was a pleasure to meet you, Rosamarine. You too, Mrs. Dorothea. Rosamarine, I feel like she's so skittish that like someone looks at her the wrong way and she's like, oh, 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 and fucking like runs for the hills. She's a real mystery, guys. All right, I want to introduce her to everyone so they're not like, who the fuck is this? Oh, my fucking ear itches, dude. Okay. There's the famed cousin. We heard all about it from Ar uh, Arianne. Allow me to introduce you, Mr. Flynn, Mr. Guido. This is my cousin, Rosmarine. Ah, it's a pleasure to meet you. Just in time for the festival, aren't you, lass? Oh, I've been hearing all about it. Make certain you make the most of it while you're here. Dude. Rosmarine's going to help me with work all week. Making your cousin work for a stay, Elise. It doesn't surprise you in the least, does it? No, Elise is very kind. It was a joke, lass. Sorry, I don't know what everybody said. Oh, oh. You're very welcome to Kaiferberg, Rosmarine. It's Rosmarine. It's time we go, Rosmarine. We have much to do. Dude, Elise can't get anyone's fucking name right. Dude, if I step on this, am I gonna get... Oh, shit. Oh, shit, the fairies are gonna come for me, guys. Oh, how dreadful! You're making a bigger deal out of this than you ought to, old Oldly. Oh, uh, what now? Oldly. Oldly here caught wind of your cousin, Elise. Heard you from Primaldorf, lass? Ah, uh, yes, from a nearby village, in truth. And your. She's the granddaughter of Granny Holly's auntie, Mrs. Oldly. Oh, uh, you've heard of her, I'm uh, you've heard of her, I'm certain. Why am I giving her the accent now? What the fuck? I suppose old Holly did spend quite some time in Primaldorf, from what I recall. That's what I've been trying to tell you. I must say, I'm still trying to figure out exactly how you two met, Elise. We met by chance. Ah, oh, that's quite different from what you... Rosmarine's granny told her about me long ago, you see. Yes, I came here in hopes of finding my relatives. Bumped into each other by the crossroads last Saturday. She asked me if I knew someone named Holly. Oh, that's a story worth telling, loss. Ah, I see. Did you hear that, old Audley? There's no need to fret. All right, well, welcome to Kaiferberg, I suppose. Thank you. It's a pleasure to be here. I kind of forgot how much, like, voice acting I had to do for this game. And it's not even good voice acting. Oh my god, there's so many people. Should I just say fuck it at this point and just like move on? Oh, we gotta go to the church at least. Okay, well there's someone who we can work with here and down like with the kids. Let's at least go to the church. Nah, it's good voice acting. It's me doing a terrible accent. <laughs> In varying levels of voice. Yo, what's up? Ah, it's you! 
The cookie lass! You know, Gruny. Ah, <sighs> Gruna. Is it Gruny? Gruna? Oh no, I'll say Gruna. That's not something you'd usually... You're ugly, Elise! You're ugly! Why, you? Is this your cat, Gruna? Oh, she's Mrs. Linda's. Her name is Lila. Oh, that's such a sweet name. Say, Cookie Lass. It's Razamarine, Gruna. Why is there a scarecrow on your shawl, Razamarine? Oh, this? My granny made it for me when I was just about your age. But it's fun, so it's good. Oh, come on. I keep it with me always because she isn't with me anymore, you see. Oh, I'm sorry. It's quite all right, Granny. I don't, I have no clue how to say her name. I'm so sorry. This girl, she's getting the short end of the stick. This is, when are you so good with children, Rosmarine? You're an ugly, old crone, Elise. You should learn from your cousin. What, you little? Grun? Gruna? Grun? I'm just going Gru. She's Gru now. <laughs> Maybe then your big nose will shrink and become nice and tiny like mine. You're literally a child. No, no. Lisa's nose isn't that pointy. That's it. We're leaving. Rosa Marine. Uh huh? You're welcome to come play with me anytime, whenever you'd like. <laughs> Several minutes. Shut up. Uh oh, you're too kind. Goodbye. I sneeze. Oh my god, sorry. The double sneeze. Ugh. Yo, I think this is the lady who was... Or maybe not, I don't know. Taking pity on beggars now, are you, Elise? There's no need to be crude, Elma. This penny beggar, Mrs. Elma, happens to be my cousin. Ah, oh, would you look at that, a cousin. I don't recall Holly having Simneens, Elise. Of course she didn't. Can't you see the poor lass has lost her wits? You're being rather unreasonable. Giving Kieferberg such a bad reputation. Why you? Truly, Elma. I must say, there's not the uh, there's no way to welcome Elise's cousin. Oh, I'm sorry. I feel I've been a bother. Not at all, lass. I apologize for this altercation. Allow me to introduce you. This is my cousin, Rosmarine. All right, I acknowledge that was rather unfortunate of me. Welcome to Kieferberg, Rosin Marine. Thank you. Wow, every such a bitch. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> Fucking small town people, dude. And they see an outsider and they're like, I take personal offense to your existence. Hell yeah, more suspicion down. I don't think we even had any suspicion at this point. Also, our mental health is like shit. That's what this bar is. Yeah, we didn't really have any suspicion to begin with. After we knock that one down. But basically, you have to be careful of what you say to who and how you say it. Um, so you don't get suspicious. <laughs> so they don't get suspicious of us. And, you know, try and, like, fucking murder us. Is uh, Hans here? Oh, we can introduce her to uh, Labgu Hanal. Ah, who is this, Elise? That look on her face means trouble. I can tell. Oh, good day. That's my cousin, Rosmarine Labguhan. A cousin? My cousin, yes. She's a distant cousin from Primaldorf related to Granny Holly's auntie, you see? <laughs> Is my line that bad? No, no, no. Stick to the story, Elise. Keep it together. It's all in your head. Uh, I'm here for the festival. It's a pleasure to meet you, Rosmarine. I'm Labguhan. Oh, it's a uh, Rosin Marine, actually. I fall into the habit of calling her Rosmarine. A habit. Oh, uh, not a habit. I didn't mean to call it. Has, Al <laughs> Has Elise shown you about town yet, Rosmarine? Uh, not yet. I only got here on Saturday, but we've been at home mostly. Saturday. I did mean to introduce you to. I've no doubt, Elise. She knows. It's no use, she sees right through me. I spend most of my time here, Rosin Marine. You know where to find me. Uh, thank you, Miss Lebkuhan. Damn, my blue bar must be low IRL. No! <laughs> not, not the bad psychic damage. Oh, no. 
No, Lab Cohen is fine. Don't, Ali uh, don't let Elise work you too hard, you hear? Very funny, Leb. Uh, oh, shit, I can't, like, walk past her. <laughs> uh, oh, okay, well, where's Father Hans? I have to, like, introduce him so he can yell at me or some fucking shit. Mm. Okay, maybe upstairs in the bell tower? Okay, never mind. <laughs> We're out of here, dude. All right, let's take on some work. Let's see what the job down here is. Also, I'm never finding that lady that Miss uh, Audley wanted me. Audley, Audley, whatever, wanted me. Okay, what is this? Um, Rosamarine can help. It'll cost you three times each, but she'll make tasks easier and avoid raising suspicion. Okay. Three? Bread? Oh, shit, I talked to him. So you weren't lying, Melly. I told you. I know what I saw. What did you tell these two, Melissa? Uh, maybe it's best we don't annoy her, Elise. Oh, you shush it, Rosmarine. Oh, watch you and your cousin play Kiss the Rat with us, Elise. I'm sorry, fucking what now? We have better things to do than play silly games with you. Oh, but Elise. Elise. No means no. Bitches ain't gonna pay me. Fuck off. Three times, I know, right? That's like all my hunger. Oops, I, oh, no, fuck. I need money. Three times bread? I can only refill two right now. What the fuck? That game can't be, <laughs> can't be sanitary. Yeah, no. Whatever the fuck kiss the rat means, hell fucking no. Little doggy. I love him. Anyway, they want to work over here, so let's go up this way. I need adults who can pay me money. Can I go this way? Oh, I can. Oh. Fuck all over there. Okay. All right. Got me there. Just have an empty bar. You can't take any damage. Any more damage? Jesus Christ. Ah, there you are. Your cousin, is it? It's a pleasure to meet you. She came all the way from Primmeldorf. Primmeldorf? That's a long way from here. Ah, uh, truly. I was thinking of... I was thinking of asking you to collect me some eggs, Elise. Yeah, let's do it. Rosmarine could come with me and lend me a hand. Ah, uh, yes! Out of my way, you feathered rat! The fucking art. <laughs> Alright, what's this mini mini game gonna be? Chicken Frenzy. Chicken Frenzy! Let's go! Egg time! Woo! Move, pick egg. Okay. Oh, it's one of Son of a bitch! Fuck! Bitch ass hoes. I'm gonna lose my mind, guys. I know there's a pattern, but my mind is like. Fuck these bitches. Fuck. Like, you gotta turn around, girl. Oh my god. The move is so slow. Damn, I shit at this game. Wow, 27. Oh, I got a B. No, there's no way. Okay, guys, I gotta be right back for a second.
Yeah, well, you can deal with it. I had to. I was getting too hot. I was gonna like explode. It costs five money. Ah, oh, fuck that. Pass. Yeah, we pass. Woo! All right. I thought two people would get more eggs. Ross Marine's not quite used to it, Mr. Wilhelm. That's all right, Elise. Here you go. Hey, yeah, we got money. We got like 32 money, nice. You still did a good job. Thank you, Mr. Eugene. Mara. The dusk now? We gotta choose a date, guys. Who are we gonna date? Should we go with Freya because we don't have a heart with her yet? Or should we go for someone else and get like a two heart? <sighs> it's best you head home now, Rosmarine. Folks have had enough of you for one day. <laughs> oh, it was so much fun, Elise. You say so. I'll see you at home then. Oh, there she goes. Bum, 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 bum. Jesus, all the dates available now, yeah. Mommy. It's you. <laughs> it's pretzel time, Elise. Oh, oh, spare me, Maggie. Waited all day, Elise. You promised a pretzel. I promised you no such thing. I I'm telling Father Hans then. Just you wait. Good luck with that, Mindy. I've already introduced her to everyone and myself. Oh, my poor beggar cousin, Rosmarine. They fell right for it, every single one of them. She she's not your cousin? <gasps> Golly, Elise, even I fell for it. No, oh, no, no. You've got it all wrong. What I meant was... I'd best go let all of those folks know, huh? Oh, if only you'd give me a pretzel. I need a pretzel, you fucking bitch ass. You better keep your wretched mouth shut, Mindy, or else. Do you tell a soul about any of this and you're as good as dead? That's what I thought. Oh, and it's fresh, too. You're so generous, Elise. Are we clear, Murphy? As long as you give me some grape juice tomorrow. So I can drown you in it. Got it. I best make certain I keep some aside for her tomorrow. This stupid bitch. All right, we'll get her stupid grape juice. Oh, I've hated her since the beginning. She's she's just a glutton though. So at least we just have to buy her like food, and she's not asking for like money. No, grape juice is probably more expensive. So. Eh. Good thing I didn't spend all my money on that fucking whatever other the the lab hens. Ooh, I can make more money right now. Aw, oh, but I want to go on the dates. All right, first things first, we gotta enter the shop. All right, I get so lonely all by myself in this inn. All right, well I'm buying, lady. Matches bandages. Oh, here we go. Oh, it's five. Oh. Dude, I should buy some for my fucking self at this point. Wait. Come back. 50! I guess it's like essentially the same thing. Buy one, two, three, three, like four. Not oh, shit, 20. Alright, whatever. Are you sure that's all, sweetheart? Yeah, bye, Miss Walma. Look, I'll be looking forward to seeing you, Elise. Yeah, sure, whatever, Lee. Yeah, but we spend money for food. Ah, uh, yeah, uh, eh, whatever. I need my items. No fucking no. Items. What? Oh, fucking one, two. Three, okay. There, we're not gonna completely pass out from like head problems. All right, guys, who's it gonna be? Who are we gonna woo tonight? We have Raza Marine, Freya, or Lebguen. The nun one? You want Lebkuhan? Okay.
I was gonna say Rosamarine, but yeah, Lepuhen is also chill. Sorry, Freya, you're just a little too plain Jane. Okay, I don't remember where she said to meet her though, so that's gonna be a whole thing. Did she say here, meet her here at the church? Ah, oh, yes, there she is. There she is. I'll spend some time with her. You'll start to grow roots standing there all day, Lebkuhen. <laughs> wine, wine make for a, pre a rather pretty flower, don't you think? For goodness sake. <laughs> <laughs> They're so cute. A little cheery for this time of day, don't you think? You're, you're the one who's had an eventful day, Elise. Too eventful for my taste, even. Mm -hmm. There's plenty to tell me about then, isn't there? Why? I think not. Mm. Came here to spend time with you, Leb. Elise. Hmm. Now, sit. Uh. Sit? <laughs> right there. Sit, sit. Yeah, girl, sit down. Now this is what I came here for. <laughs> Beats standing, wouldn't you say? I spoil you I spoil you a little too much, I say. <laughs> Not like I'd have it any other way, anyhow. You're telling me all about you're telling me all about it later, Elise. About those shoes and about that lass. Mm. Alright, alright. Not one more word about this nonsense now, you hear? Mm. Fine. Still, Elise, I thought you knew. Knew what? About what happened earlier today. Oh, it's probably best I tell you about it later. Girl, what? <laughs> what happened? For sake. To think you're a proper nun, more like an imp. <laughs> you're truly so easy to tease, Elise. Easier or not, Leb. You better not be hiding anything from me. You get to keep secrets that I don't? So there is something. I wouldn't say I'm keeping it from you, but... You'll think I'm untrusting, Elise. What? You see, I've been thinking about you. All of Kieferberg knows you won't stay here forever. Will you? That's a different issue altogether, Elise. Seems to me they're quite the same, if I'm honest. Be that as it may, what am I to do when you're gone, Elise? You're... how to put it... Your only comfort in this dull place? You're also very much irritating, like an imp, I'd say. Mm -hmm. Am I now? Terribly so. Didn't think I could read you that easily, did you? Mm -hmm. My, I might just throw you in the well at this rate. I might drown, Lab, and then you'd really be left without me. Oh, <laughs> I'm well aware, Lab Kuhen. You're not the only one who thinks fondly of what we have, but... But? It doesn't mean we can't be together someplace else, does it? <gasps> oh, shit! <laughs> you hadn't thought of it like that, had you? <laughs> Anyhow... I'll be waiting for you by the fountain tomorrow afternoon. Don't be late, Elise. Uh oh. I see. For goodness sake. Yippee! Leibschweiss. Or Leibschweiss. I can fucking read anything ever. Oh shit, it's night. I like Lebkuhan a lot. She's like. She's funny and sweet. I think my second favorite would be um, Rosin Marine, and then Freya's just kind of like normal, <laughs> normal girl. Uh, yeah, we have to meet her tomorrow in the square. All right, let's save. Meet Lamguhan at the bakery. On your way home. On your way home, Elise. Quite late, I'm aware. Our fellows are out on patrol for a reason, lass. 
Still not certain, it's for a good reason, if I'm honest. Me too, Mr. Gustav, I must say I don't quite see the use for it. Gustav here just doesn't want to make the rounds, I think. I'd say getting good night's um, I'd say getting a good night's sleep would do us all better. Old Johan's preaching does more harm than good. Could be right for all we know. I struggle to fear something I haven't seen yet, Wilhelm. Truly, there's no such thing as a witch. My only comfort is knowing it'll keep Freya well rested. You two, Elise, you and your cousin can sleep comfortably tonight. Well, that's good. I'm sure I could, like, fuck around and do other shit, but let's just go home. We gotta get home to our girl, Rosin Marine. Oh shit, why is, like, the darkness, like, cloying around us? What the fuck? I don't like that. What the fuck? Yo, it's Labguhan! Can I at least, like, go see my girl? Don't you start, Labguhan. I'm not explaining myself again. My lips are sealed. You can stand there looking at me all you want. She's a rather sweet lass, I must say. Labguhan! I know you, Elise. She's my cousin. There's nothing more to it. Oh, could you say that again? She's, um, you know... No, I don't know, Elise. That's why I'm asking. Now that we got that out of the way, won't you tell me who she is? She says she's a traveler. I found her hiding in my gra uh, granary on Saturday. A traveler? I'm not convinced either, Leb, but I felt sorry for the poor lass. She says she'll be leaving right after the festival, so it's only temporary. What does she come here to do? She won't tell me much herself. I had no intention of bringing her to Kieferberg, but she graced us with her presence, I suppose. I had to think of something right then and there. Please. I shouldn't be housing a stranger, let alone put myself in harm's way for her, but... I understand, Elise. Oh, Leb. I also understand that you're telling- well, what you're telling me is a uh, half-truth at best. Here's your bread. You'll let me know if you need more, won't you? No, she gave me bread! I trust you all the same, Elise. You don't have to help me, Leb. You know that. Yet here I am. Look at me, Elise. I do trust you. I need you to know that. All right. Stay out of trouble now. I'll see you tomorrow. Girl, you definitely will see me tomorrow. That is if I don't fucking die on the way home. Totally not creepy. Jeez! Guys, do you think I can go up to the windmill or whatever? I'm like waiting for it to be open. Like with bated breath. Not so this way. Girl, what the fuck are we doing? Where the scary? It was last- there was spooky time last time. I'm gonna see if I can get there. Oh, it's still here. See, the scary's behind this. If I can get that to get open. But it's also a dating sim. <laughs> so we get to date these cute little girls. Well, not little girls. We get to take- we get- we get to date these cute women who are the same age as us. Are we a little girl? I think we're like a young adult. Nice save. Listen. <laughs> I don't like children. Uh. I, I legitimately, I fucking hate children. Alright, what's up, girl? Elise. Oh, there you are, Elise. It's quite late, isn't it? Spare me the earful, Rosmarine. What's there to sweep out here after nightfall, anyhow? I'm sorry. I was keeping myself busy until you came home is all. And Flock here was amusing himself chasing after the broom. Where'd you, Flock? Yo, Flock is so fucking cute. What's for supper then? Yes. Oh, I made grape soup. Gr grape soup? Soup? I figured we could both use something hearty. We have eggs. What about eggs? I cooked those too. I thought we could toast some of yesterday's bread to half with them. Oh, thank goodness. Girl, same. I'm not the biggest fan of soup. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I... Oh, excuse me. Did I do something wrong? 
Naggy toast ought to be enough for today, I suppose. Let's head inside, Rosmarine. What? It's nothing. Elise, wait! It's tastier than it looks, isn't it? Could have been worse, that's for certain. Neither takes the good when you're hungry, I find. I suppose today went well, all things considered. I best keep an eye on her unless these folks. I'm sorry, I... Say, Elise, I've been meaning to ask you something. Girl, what? Hmm? Those shoes you found this morning. Now that you mention it. What about them? You still haven't told me much about them. I've seen them before in my dreams a long time ago. In your dreams? I'm sorry, I... Elise, is there something you're not telling me? You mean like I took a contract and now I have to like give something up? Uh... I don't know where to start, Rosmarine. I've been avoiding thinking about it, but this morning in Kaiferberg... Kaiferberg, I... Wait, Elise. Our fates, Elise, they're finally starting to align. Huh? Girl, what? <laughs> oh, never mind. Rosemarine. Saw an old hag, Rosmarine. She told me about this patron saint in the woods. That he grants folks' wishes if they bring him gifts. Oh shit, right, the fucking gifts. So it's true after all. Girl, what? You've heard about all of this before? That's why she came here. It was here. At this moment that he knew he fucked up. That's why she came here, isn't it? Carry on, carry on. She said I must bring him three gifts: the tender flesh, sweetest nectar, and good company. That's wonderful! What else did she say? Did she mention your fate? For goodness sake! For goodness sake, Rosmarine! You're scaring me with all this nonsense! <laughs> oh, there's nothing to be afraid of, Elise! No, I... How do you know about all of this? It's an old folktale my granny used to tell me. Uh... A folktale? Mm -hmm. Carry on now. What else did she say? She mentioned finding a dwelling in the woods that he will grant my wish if I bring him the three gifts made from these testaments. You told her your wish, didn't you? I did, but it's nothing out of the ordinary. It's... Don't tell me! Huh? You can't tell other folks about your wish, Elise. Rosmarine, you have to tell me what's going on. All I know is what my granny told me, but I can tell you all about it, Elise. I can help you. Rosemarine. Rosemarine, I... I need to think about this. I'll be here tidying up. You can ask me anything you like. All right. What the fuck? Oh yeah, the gifts are fucked up. It was like, flesh someone of good company. Or like some... Next sweet nectar. Hold on, let me get get a drink. All right, girly, what's up? Tell me. Rosmarine, you don't have to look so frightened, Elise. This is all very overwhelming, is all. Oh, Elise, isn't fate such a wonderful thing? Enough of that, Rosmarine. What are these testaments and gifts? Ah, oh, of course. In order to meet him, you're going to have to gather the testaments of to, uh, to your resolve. These are tools and ingredients you'll have to use when crafting the gifts. It's common courtesy to bring your host nice gifts when visiting, isn't it? Uh huh. Ah, oh, there's also the trials, but I can tell you all about his folktale later. All right, then. For now, I want to know... What the fuck is the tender flesh? I don't quite like the sound of it, but... Oh, you're the one making it sound bad, Elise. The tender flesh represents your body, the vessel of your uh, for your soul, soul, so to speak. Oh, my God. The 
a representation of my own flesh then. All that matters is that it carries a part of your mortal body. Huh? It's nothing to be afraid of, Elise. It can be a nail clipping or a strand of hair. What's important is the connection between you and the symbi uh, symbiotic symbolic. Oh my god, I can read. Vessel. A symbolic vessel. Rosemarine. What is the sweetest nectar? It's not as though I don't have an idea, but I don't quite like it. It represents your vitality, at least your essence. You don't mean blood, right? All that matters is that it carries a part of your mortal body. Part of my mortal body, huh? I know what you're thinking, Elise. That could be it, but well, that's what you're. If, but if that's what you're inclined to bring him, but what is it, Rosmarine? These are meant as proof of your resolve. First and foremost, your, it's your determination that's most important, Re Elise. Oh, Rosmarine. What is a good company? I don't know what to think of this one. You should meet him when your soul is at its most vulnerable, Elise. At its most vulnerable? Granny used to say good company brings one's innermost self to light. One's true face, in other words. Rosmarine, I'm not sure I understand. Why, it's love, Elise. Love? No, I was hoping it wouldn't be fucking the one that we get closest to. Love reveals all, wouldn't you say? I suppose. <sighs> I need time to think. I still can't wrap my head around this nonsense, ro nonsense Rosmarine. That's all right, Elise. I'll be here if you have any more questions. I think I need a moment. Bring him gifts made out of the testaments, and I'm supposed to find these somewhere. Where? Hmm. Go to bed. Well, I guess it's time to sleep. I can't wait to have fucking nightmares again. Creepy ass nightmares where I get the shit beat out of me. Gifts, huh? I'd best go to bed. I'll make sense of this all tomorrow. I'll make sense of all of this tomorrow, rather. Ah, oh, my favorite time. Horror hour. For goodness sake. I can't sleep. I can't stop thinking about all this nonsense. Girl. Everything that old hag told me about the testaments, the gifts, about him. But Rosmarine told me too. I find it hard to believe, but maybe, maybe it's true. If I do gather these testaments, if I do find a way to him, my way to him, maybe I can finally leave this wretched town and life that live the life I meant to live. Start anew, someplace far, far away. This could very, very well be my chance for happiness. I had to at least try. I have to go to the woodland and find out right now. Or we're gonna fucking die. Uh, are we like. Oh, we're fucking starving. I'm like, what? Do we look like delusional? No, we're just like fucking starving, dude. Alright, um. I'll eat the one pretzel. And then we'll eat. Um, two of the breads. This way I'm not gonna, like, pass the fuck out. <laughs> that is such a bad idea. Yeah! I'll be real, I don't even know how to get there. It's like... Well, I'll save first. No, oh, fucking wrong button. Um... Alright. There we go, save. <laughs> Witching hour. Oh, that's great. We all love 3 a.m. The witching hour. Ah. Basically the hour when all things go bad or wrong. Alright, so the woods should be like down this way. Wait. Ooh, I'm actually curious. Wait, is it open now because it's the witching hour? No. Okay. Get fucked, I guess. Hmm. I really want to know what's in the windmill. 
right, we gotta go to like the crossroads over here. Yeah, what could go wrong, guys? It's the perfect time to go wandering in the woods then. Yeah, it's like the perfect time to do literally anything. I guess I could save here too. I'm getting stuck on stone, dude. Wrong button. I'd rather save here just so we're closer to whatever we need to do in case we die. Tiffle! Wait, our money's called Tiffle? Oh, this totally isn't freaky deaky at all. Oh, she used a lot. A match. Let's see if what that old hag said is true. Together, at, at least give it a try. Girl, I don't know about that. We could also just like pack it up and go home and oh my god. Fucking what? Ugh. So this is the woodland. I ought to find him. I ought to be brave. Girl, I don't know if it's worth it. The fuck? And I can't run. So that's great. Oh, this is just great. Yeah. Um, what is, this? what is this wretched place? I'd best be careful. This could be dangerous. No shit. Oh, fuck. Find the secret in the woods. Is that like a dream? Oh my god. Okay. What? I didn't know those things would attack me. These moths aren't going anywhere, are they? I mean. Technically. Doesn't seem to be working, huh? Oh, a candle holder? What is this thing doing so deep in the woods? I suppose maybe we light this then? Doesn't seem like this is what I should be using here. Um... Oh my god, the toy horse. Ah, <sighs> maybe if I try something else. There's a wick, I can light this candle, I wonder. Bro, you mean like I was trying to fucking do? Why are they carnivorous? I I don't know. Oh my god, yes! I know! Girl, you're gonna have to use one of these fucking things. Wait, what's this? Oh. Ointment. Well, that's great! I'm definitely gonna fucking need that. Alright. Well, not yet. I could probably use a bandage, though. Ugh. Fit through this passage. If only I could do away with, these, away with these mods somehow. Well, obviously we have to light this. Girl, I don't know. Can you fucking light it? Like you'd think. Oh yes, use the lantern. Fine. Oh, I have an idea. What the fuck? 
I guess, light this, and then the moths will come over, like... Yeah? I had the wrong button. Shut up! <laughs> what is this Curse of Monkey Island logic? Oh my god, what? <sighs> Oh my god, please. <sighs> okay, cool. Is it- I just noticed that the matches is on control. Am I literally supposed to hit control? It's the same thing! It's the same fucking thing from the menu! What the fuck? Why did it have to be specifically I have to hit control? I don't remind me of the madness that is Thweepwood. What? Girl, so help me. Oh, for Christ's sake. Ah! Ah! Why? Why was that the answer? Got their intention, I suppose. Gotta be careful moving forward. Well, what about the- ah! What the fuck is this? What in the- Have you met the witch? She's so very eager to meet you again, would you believe? The witch, you say? Your paths are bound to cross before long, but... I have my doubts you'll last long in the black dim wilderness. Wait! What in the Lord's name? Yo, can I have the dress? Such a foul smell. Moth eaten, frayed an old dress rests in its blood soaked grave. Oh shit, never mind. No, I'm fucking good. Alright. Items. Hmm, we're probably just gonna have to take more damage. Yo, what's this? Matches. Oh, thank god for that match I accidentally wasted. Like set it on fire. Let's not. Dude, all it did was put my fucking three wood. I don't even know who or what that is. Set it on fire. Oh, I can't do shit. Oh, the main character of the Monkey Island too. I know of Monkey Island, but that's one of the Sierra games that I like haven't played or seen someone play. Jesus Christ. Dude, Sierra games were a different fucking thing. Oh. Oh. Okay, that makes sense. Like, duh, you can jump down and... Hmm. There's something over there I'm gonna have to get. Okay, so it's like a kind of little puzzle thing. 
I got a mushroom. Let's go. Don't do mushrooms or maybe do mushrooms. I don't fucking know. I have to get like way up there, dude. Big brain time? Yeah. I don't know. I fell down by accident. I was like, wait a second. Oh, wait a gosh darn second. What's over here? Oh, there's like a thing over there. Well, that's great. Yeah, okay, now we're like all the way back here. That's even better. I don't think that mushroom is safe. No, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Oh. The fucking music is so freaky. You're blessed then or cursed depending on how you look at it. I was thinking of playing, uh, cause they did- Oh shit, it's that fucking symbol. Cause they did bring them to, uh, Steam, yeah? There's so many, I must find a way to distract them. This is that fucking symbol again. Um... Okay. Pick it up. Well, I already saw- Yo, another mushroom? I already saw that, like, way over here, there's a thing. Yeah, here it is. Wait, it lit up? Okay, I assume there has to be more, though. Matches. What about- Yeah, 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 there's one over here, too. Simply lighting it might not be enough. Yeah, I don't think it is, but at least they're lit. So I'm probably gonna have to do is get half and half. Yep, okay. There's one half. Steam, maybe, epic, definitely all. I don't really use epic! Just because there's not enough games on there for me to like give a fuck about epic <laughs> is all at this point. I'm just like, uh. What the hell is this? What is this? Looks like a doe's remains. I've never seen such a thing before. The pristine skeletal remains of a doe, every bone barren of any life. Oh, that's fucked up. Alright, well, we're gonna save. Because if I die, I don't want to redo all this shit. <laughs> I have quite a few uh, free games in Epic that I never play. Yeah, I mean, Epic tends to have, like, free game stuff where you can get games for free, which is fine. But I think the only games I have on Epic is, like, Fortnite that I played one time. <laughs> and, like, some free games I got that, like, I won't play because it was just like, oh, I got a game for free, but yeah. I like it because of uh, weekly free games and their occasional month of daily free games. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, which is fine. I'm not saying, like, oh, damn. I kind of got over the whole to Epic versus Steam stuff. I don't really care. Wherever I can get shit the cheapest. I've been spotting these scribbles scattered about. Are these people? Engraved deep into the rocky surface are several familiar shapes reminiscent of human life. Girl, are we sure about that? The only game I play on Epic is satisfactory. Yeah. Oh, so it's the same. It's that symbol again. Let's just walk over the corpse and just like. Also, oh, there's a fucking safe spot here. What the hell? And those are drawn to flesh, it seems. I had to lure them out of the way, but keep following me if I don't turn off my lantern. Ah. So you have to do it like this. Okay. Is there anywhere else I can like light something? Shit. Hmm. There's much light in here, so maybe I can draw them to this carcass. I've seen the skeleton of remains of a doe. Okay. I trapped myself. Guys. Guys, I trapped myself. <laughs> oh, 
Oh my god, what the fuck? Those fucking mods ate us alive. Holy shit. Continue, yeah. Fall Guys and Evil Within series. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna have to be smarter about this. Okay, so we're gonna... Okay, there. Now I'm not trapped. I took damage, but at least I'm not trapped this time. Okay. Looks like it's gonna be a lot of cat and mouse. Oh, we got a free juice. Yo! Um, another fucking mushroom. What are these mushrooms? Oh! We can eat them! There we go. Now I'm not dead. Yeah, the game over scene is so cool. Alright. Oh, they're devouring that thing, huh? Maybe they'll clear the path for me if I lure them all here, but I'll keep following me if I don't turn off the lantern. Back, well, that's great. Shit. Shit! Alright, guys, I might have to kill myself <laughs> again, like on purpose. Jesus Christ. Soft lock? Yeah. Yeah, I kind of soft locked myself. Oopsie! Okay, I got, I got it this time. I can- I can figure this out. Got matches. So what we're gonna do is I'm going to... Uh... Get this item first. Bop, 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 bop. Okay. Do that light again. We're gonna save. Because then at least I don't have to keep fucking doing that over and over again. So the reason I did the second one is because I was like, oh are those the ones that are over like over there? But there's another one over there. So let's see. Mushroom. Mushroom, mushroom. Dude, there's this like restaurant chain called Mushroom Pizza and they have really good pizzas. <laughs> I know they're not all mushroom pizzas, that's just the name of it. I didn't see what was down here. A mushroom! Are these cats? When spotting these scribbles scattered about, are these people? Hmm. Hmm. Damn, now I want pizza, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I, I have an idea. So I'm gonna save because I just got all that shit, so. So what I'm gonna do is... Shit. You can only have cursed... You have cursed my... Longer of pizza only can cure... Only pizza can cure... Oh my god. You I've cursed you with uh only... You have to eat pizza now, yeah. Okay, so. <laughs> now that I'm over here. What the fuck? We golden maidens aren't to be sneered at. You'll understand in time, I'm certain. Why would you say that? My, 
you can't possibly be thinking can't possibly think he'll give you his blessing. I was told otherwise. Oh, such naivety. How amusing you are! I can't wait to welcome you. What an infuriating character. Hmm. Leather purse. What? Oh, well, that was great for our mental health. Well, good thing we found an extra... If I can fucking use the right thing. An extra grape reduce I can use. And yeah, we'll heal. Alright, what was that pouch we got, though? No, oh, it's just something I can fucking sell. What the hell? So there's nothing of importance over here? I've been scammed? Alright, alright. I got this. Don't worry about it. Also, I'm gonna save. <laughs> I don't want to do all that shit again. There might be an achievement if you see all the golden women. Okay. Don't, don't worry about it. Best scams are free money scams. No! No, no scams. Okay, five more matches. Wow, that was totally worth that, I guess. Anyway. Clear the path for me. If I lure them all here, but they'll keep following me if I don't turn on my life. Okay. I'll get it, I'll get it. Am I fucking HP though? Big brain gaming now. I don't know if it's big brain gaming. It's just I am need to lure them and hopefully stop taking damage because I'm a stupid bitch. Okay, they're going to devour that thing. Oh, there they go. Well. All right. Hopefully there's a save up here. Otherwise, I might be fucked. <laughs> Um, that's my head. Hold on. Um. What? What the fuck? Oh my god. Come to me at last. <gasps> Don't be frightened, Elise. Come closer. No. How about no? What is this? What in the world? What in the Lord's name? Done well to find your way into these woods. <gasps> It's imperative, Elise, that you listen to me closely. He's once more trying to take you away from me, but not for long. Huh? Take this basket now. You ought to gather the gifts in it, Elise. Gifts, you say? Find your way to him deeper in this grove of mine. Only then may you wit your wish come to fruition, my beloved. 
What are you? I'll guide you to him, Elise. You ought to trust my word. I don't fucking know about that. Your precious wish will be safe with me. How am I to find him? You, Elise, are my kin, my triumph, my beloved progeny. What he's done to me is no matter all I want, it's you. What the fuck? Oh, it's an old lady. I will allow him and his pets into my woodland once more. <gasps> I will allow him to tempt you to toy with you. W what are you? All for the greater good, my beloved. So that we can be reunited. So that I can bear life in my womb once more. I'm sorry, I'm fucking what? I need to get out of here. So I can retrieve what's mine. Ah! 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 I hear the red bones! Hey, what happens if I go back? Oh shit. Fuck! Fuck, 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 fuck. Grip and go home to Ross Marine. Now fuck this basket. She fucking got that shit beat on me. What do you mean basket menu? <gasps> oh, it's Flock. Flock. What are you doing here? What the fuck? I thought you'd be in the granary or how and about. Goodness, I don't feel so good. What is it, Flock? I don't like the way he's staring at me. What the fuck? What are you? Roz Marine? What? What are you doing here? Look. I was. Uh, I was out on a walk. Come on, not the fart reverb. Fuck off. <laughs> this late at night? What is it, Flock? Come, um, let's go home, Rosmarine. I don't want to stay out here a minute longer. Oh, but I... uh, Elise, wait! What the fuck? What the <sighs> fuck? It's morning already. Girl, we are like on our last leg, fucking about to die. Suppose I really did go to the woodland, didn't I? Mm. I don't know what to think of all. I uh, think of all that, but. Both Rosmarine, the old, and the old hag, neither were lying, it seems. I had to pull myself together. It's best I head out for work now. I'll lose my wits if I keep. Rosmarine and Frock. Flock? What are they doing out there? We burn the witch, we burn the whole fucking woodlands down. Find your way home, I sure did. I have no food. 
Why well, have ointment? Oh my god. I'm like not gonna die. Jesus Christ, I am hungry though. Not the cute one though, yeah. Not not our little rosin marine. Story event available. Holy shit, guys. I thought they were at back here. Or maybe they're out by the granary. Hello? Hello? Where the fuck are they? Also, wasn't she supposed to clean that? It's all cobwebby still. Jesus Christ. Ooh. Oh, there they are. <laughs> you two are always making merry, huh? Good morning, Elise. I don't trust that fucking goat no more. Good morning to you two, flock. Pick some mushrooms this morning, Elise. We can have them for breakfast. Say, Rosmarine, you put flock away in the granary last night, right? Of course, I think he's taking a liking to a liking to it too. Always leave the door leave the door a little ajar just in case. I see. Is that so? Elise. Is everything all right, Elise? You seem to be on edge last night too. It's nothing, Rosmarine. I had strange dreams, is all. I know you went to the woods, Elise. Mm. I'm sorry, but... You don't have to tell me about it, but... You know now, don't you, that I'm speaking the truth. Mm. Elise. Girl... We need to burn this whole place down. <sighs> Anyhow, come along. Let's head to work. Taking me to town? <laughs> we have to stick to our story, don't we? Come now, let's head to town. Ah, uh, wait for me, Elise. <laughs> now you fucking stay behind, Flock. <laughs> Fuck you, freaky, dicky bitch. <laughs> you be a good boy now, Flock. We'll be back later. How come that goat likes you so much? He doesn't seem to be too fond of me. Uh, it's a little embarrassing, but I made it happy to carry food for him in my pockets, you see. So you bribe him, that's it. Oh, I can't help myself, Elise. Hmm. 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 I don't like that. I don't like that goat. I never liked the goat. I don't trust that fucking goat. Help if I stop running into shit. We gotta take our poor ass over there to. <gasps> it's open! It's best I come back some other time. I guess when we don't have. Oh shit, guys, it's open. <gasps> Alright. Yeah, the woodlands were so fucking creepy. I hated it there. Now you know why everybody's like, yeah, don't go to the woodlands. Yeah, no. Damn. It's almost time we see what's inside. Yeah. Okay, uh, can we afford any food today? That's the real question. I think I can order, like, one thing. Bread, 10. I should probably get pretzels. Or a pretzel. I can also heal. Um. Bye. I'm too broke for this life. All 
All right, time to go get some work, make that cash. Where is everyone? Oh, do folks usually gather here? I wonder if something happened. Time to get that bread for real, for real. <laughs> Come now, Rosmarine. We must find out what's going on. Uh, yes. Yeah, girl, it's weird that there's literally no one here. I'm guessing they're in church. Oh, there's some people over there. No one in church? Damn. Dude, not even Lebkuhan is in church? Bread, where is- I got a pretzel. I don't got no bread, though. Two, four. No, Elise! Mr. Eugene's got- uh, Mr. Eugene's horses got stolen. What? Is that true, Mrs. Uh, uh, Merrily? I'm not a liar, Elise. Yes, I'm afraid it's true. It's acting strange, Elise. That's natural, my dear. This isn't something to take lightly. I even heard some. F uh, I even heard some folks were saying Hagridden. Hagridden? You shouldn't spread such nonsense about town. But all well, Johan said the horses were stolen by the witch. Oh, for goodness' sake! Poor lad couldn't be more heartbroken. For, for good reason. Go on now. I'll be looking after the children for the time being. The fuck that dude like just bought those horses. What the fuck? He was literally just yesterday being like, yeah, I bought some horses. Yo, what's going on, girlies? Ah, uh, Elise, Ross and Marine. G good morning, Freya. Love, Kuhan. You've heard, I'm assuming, about Mr. Eugene's horses? Oh, it's been awful. Everyone's been on edge. Folks don't know what to do with themselves. For good reason, I'd say, but... Mr. Eugene was so invested in his business, too. Old Johan's foolery isn't helping anyone, I can already tell. They were hag-ridden. Something tells me you know what that means. Love, Kuhan. Ah, uh, of course it's when... Oh, she wouldn't know, Love, Kuhan. I'm saved! I suppose not. What if she takes pretzels? <laughs> Damn. She might. <sighs> what a way to start the day. I think I'll take a look about town. Better be careful, Elise. Folks are getting rather nervous about this. I get it, Lebkuhan. I'll be careful not to rile them up. Don't rile themselves up. I wouldn't know about that, Dorothea. Ah, there you two are. You can always think. We can always ask Elise Brunhilde. Ask me about what, Miss Dorth uh, Mrs. Dorothea? Oh, but before we do, have you heard, Elise? About Mr. Eugene's horses, I know. Oh, the poor lad. To think my father's name is com uh, compromised, too. Mr. Bernhard Hard Bernhalds. Someone put one of the horse's saddles on one of my father's pigs, Elise. What the fuck? It's a sick joke, that's what it is. She said she takes salami pizza before, so I'm guessing so. <laughs> uh, fair. Sounds like uh, sounds like it from what I'm hearing. Oh, Elise, you're leaving Kaiferberg, aren't you? Maybe one day, Mrs. Brunhilde, but are you? And discussing the idea as a matter of fact. Oh, how could this happen to us? I hear that stupid little bitch head out here somewhere. Where is she? Where's she hiding? Where that little shithead hiding? The fuck? I heard her. Where is she? Literally, where? Where? Come out! Oh no, it's this person. Oh, never mind. I thought it was that bitch asking for her her grape. 
Riding pigs, let's go. Who's riding? Who's hiding? Oh, Miffy or Muffy or whatever. Molly, whatever her fucking name is. Not to let him know haunted me, Marlin. This is about the horses. It goes further than that, at least. Whoever took Eugene's horses broke into the pigsty. Took our pig, saddled him like a horse, and locked him in the stables. You believe such a thing, Elise? A vile prank, that's what this is. Need folks know, uh, to know Bernhard had nothing to do with this. Do about this. Well, if Kaiferberg knows, you would never do such a thing, Marlin. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear about that. We'll see where this takes us, I suppose. Thank you, lass. What in the Lord's name is going on? Yeah, what the fuck? Who would do that? Like, why bother? Taking Eugene's horses was too cruel. Uh, I wonder who could do such a thing. Poor lad was just getting his business started too. Hard to believe he'd be provoked by any ill will. I doubt any of our Tolan's folk could do such a thing. I agree, Heinrich. I've heard Lisbeth's goats aren't doing so well either. All right, well, we'll go have a look. Keep calm when it comes to old Johan El Elise. He's very much convinced this was the witch's doing. Just what we needed, isn't it? Come, Rosmarine, let's go to the stables. Ah, good, good day. All right, let's go out there. All right, what's going on? Oof. <sighs> there you are, you two. We're not looking, you're not looking so cheerful, Mrs. Lisbeth. Oh, it's difficult to say cheerful with all these going-ons. It's so unfortunate. You'd have to wonder who'd do such a thing. It can't have been easy, that's for certain. Yeah, it's like a bunch of horses and what? Now Lisbeth's goats are feeling ill too. Oh, Arnion, that's such a loss. Feeling ill, Mrs. Elizabeth? The mil uh, this milk's the milk's giving off this foul smell since yesterday. Their eyes are looking glassy too. I don't know what to think of it. You think they're possessed? Only one who could lend me a hand is Eugene, but you wouldn't want to trouble him. I see. You'll be fine, my dear. We'll have a word with Father Hans, all right? Goddamn. Okay, well, here's like majority of the townsfolk, or rather, all the men. What's up here? Alright, the fucking mill. Can't wait to do all these men in different voices, except I forget each one every time. Hmm. You two have heard, I'm sure. We have. Though we're trying to figure out what happened. I'm ruined, that's what happened. <sighs> As I said before, Eugene, we will do all we can to help. We'll gather all the lads and send them out to patrol the outskirts. Are we absolutely certain they were stolen? About that, at least. Those horses were hag-ridden, I tell ya. Not this nonsense again. I tell ya, lad, there's a witch in Kieferberg. I mean, even if they're, they were Hagridden, it's still a sad day for Mr. Eugene, old, Ms. Oh, old Johan. This isn't the time. I'll ask you not to try the folks' patience, old Johan. Or anyone else's for that matter. He's getting out of hand. Which or no which, folks. Someone had to do it, no two ways about it. Without as much as a trot or a neigh. All there is, was when I got here was Bernard's pig in a saddle. Don't rope me into this, lad. I already told you I had nothing to do with it. Who am I to blame them then? The witch? <sighs> Let's keep calm now, folks. Wait, so there's no tracks or anything? <sighs> Can't fault a poor lad for it, can we, folks? Finn, Guido, and I will take a look around the outskirts. I'll go with you, Gustav. We should ask Eugene if he'd like to join us too. Is there any way we can help Mr. Gustav? Keep folks calm, Elise, and go about your day as you normally would. Leave it to us, lads. We'll get to the bottom of this. Folks truly are on edge today. I'll be careful with what I say about town. 
Yeah, this is like really bad. One, how the fuck did this happen? Two, what the fuck? Alright, so we're at mid, uh, mid date. Story event available, romantic date available, task available. Okay. Um, get him to join a search party, I take it. Oh, I don't think I'd be of much help. I was wondering if there's anything I could do to help with. I appreciate the thought, lass. We're at a bit of a loss, you see. How so, Mr. Heinrich? We can't put our finger on where to start, and we wouldn't want to search Kieferberg. Last thing we want is to get under folks' skin. I understand. To search as far and wide as we can, there's no two ways about it. Even if only a couple of footprints, uh, we ought to find something. May the Lord hear you, Heinrich. Or may the Lord- I read that in the wrong fucking- You know what? You get it. <laughs> you don't seem too hopeful, Mr. Eugene. Robber stallions don't vanish overnight, lass. Whoever did it knew exactly what they were doing, I'd say. Interesting. Can we go in here? I remember seeing a snake or two hiding in this hay not long ago, stacked with hay and firewood, Kieferberg stables, house, uh, much of the town's livestock. Okay, so it's like kind of like a shared stable then. It's not just like, just this dude stuff. I don't know why, but I love this smell. Several stalks of corn stand tall, their leaves a vibrant dark green. Wait, why did that freak out? What? Why did that, like, do that? What the fuck? Totally weird. How do they get their wheat to grow this tall, I wonder? Fully well, packed in golden, the wheat pads sway gently in the spring breeze. Hmm. What's over here? Fucking nothing. All right, understood. We got cabbages. Granny Holly used to have plenty of cabbages in our backyard. Several cabbages have flourished on the field nearly ripe enough to be picked. Hmm. What is this? Hey, how ya doing? Wait, anything over here? This is just a bread mill. Hmm. <laughs> I guess we're going down. Maybe down and around. I don't know. What does it say? Oh, it's just left alleyway. Uh, down Kieferberg Inn. Why am I getting like all the rewinding? I stepped in the circle. Stack them so neatly for Mr. Eugene, and look at them now. In the corner, various bundles of hay have been raked together in a disorganized pile. God damn, what the fuck? Um, um. Alright. Wait, she- there she is. There's that bitch. Mommy. It's you! Pretending not to see me? Who are you? For goodness sake, Maggie, I don't have time for this. Give me the great juice, Elise. I didn't have br breakfast today, so... That's it, I'm telling your auntie you're begging for food again. <laughs> oh, oh, but I'm not be begging, Elise. I saw you have a goat now. Why am I not allowed to have a goat? <laughs> Golly, Elise, you're dirt poor. How would you get your hands on a goat? Happy. Why, you... <laughs> See, I see we have an understanding, Elise. Now pass the grape juice or someone's getting an earful. Okay, fine. You can have your stupid ass fucking grape juice, you bitch. Here you go, you glutton. Dare tell anyone about the wretched goat and I swear I'll... Oh boy, oh boy. You're so generous, Elise. I can't believe that this is working. Why, you? I'm going to start blackmailing you a lot sooner if I... Out of my sight, Mindy. <laughs> Bring me some Lebkuhan tomorrow, won't you? Go away. Goodness, Goodness sake. She's going to work me like a donkey at this rate. What a fucking bitch. Okay, what's this? A leather purse. Yo, all right. We can like sell this stuff and get some money. Hell yeah. We're going to talk. Okay. So I'm going to go make some money by selling this garbage in my pocket. <laughs> 
And then we're gonna save and all that'll be it for today because we're at the end and I swear if I start talking to these people I'm gonna be talking for fucking ever dude. And yeah Miffy, Mindy, Molly, whatever the fuck her name is. Uh, she's a bitch. I fucking hate her What a little sh shithead dude How can I help you, darling? Well, okay, I'm selling. So I want to sell uh, this toy horse and uh, these two thingies. Hell yeah, we made money. Are you sure that's all, sweetheart? Goodbye, Miss Walma. Miss Wal Walma, whatever. You have such lovely features, did you know that? Girl, what the fuck? Girl, what? What the fuck? Christ. All right, we're gonna save here in town. Yes. We'll save on number four. Hey, yeah. Hey. All right, let's get out of here. I hit the wrong button. <laughs> we're exiting. We're exiting. Yeah, 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 get me out of here. All right, there we go. Oh, let's move over. Hello. All right, well, that's it for today. Thank you so much, everybody, for watching me. Well, there's live on YouTube. It means the world to me, as always. Let's, let, me, let me move this over so I can at least find someone to raid. But yes, yes, yes. Uh, you can catch me. We have a Discord. You can join the Discord for news and, you know, notifications, hang out, whatever you want to do. Uh, my socials, of course. You can catch me on Twitch, YouTube, Twitter, Blue Sky, and TikTok. Those are my new handles on everything. Thanks again for another amazing stream. No problem. No problem. All right, let me... There we go. And search like this. Let's see if there's someone I can find. I like how I put it like low to high and then it's like showing me people in the 200s. Like I know there are other people. Where are the people who are like one? Ah, oh, thanks, Ruru. Thanks for the beanies. Thanks for being here. Uh, let's see, what was it? Oh yeah, and thanks for the sub. Thank you so much. Ah. Uh, I think. Oh my god, who, who who should I raid? Oh shit, this is like actually hard. Um. Okay, I think I know who I'll raid. Never mind, I think they're stopping. <laughs> Never mind, I think they're ending stream. Oh shit! I have to browse the, the old fashioned way because the fucking raid thing sucks ass, apparently. No, I want tag low to high here we go what the fuck why wouldn't he just like do this who looks interesting ba -bum, sorry oh god that's me i don't want to see my fucking self dude <laughs> oh man twix getting it right at the end the little login bum, bum, bum. Not. I'm fucking dying, guys. I'm gonna be real. I might just have to like leave because <laughs> it's so hot. You've been lurking. I totally forgot about that. Yeah. <sighs> I 
Yeah, I think I'm just gonna have to go. I I'm I'm too hot for this. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. <laughs> My head is broken. Um, we're just gonna end stream. No raid. I know I should probably raid people, but I'm too tired for this anyway. Thank you for coming and watching. I stream live on Twitch every Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday, 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. EDT because it's daylight saving time right now. Ooh -wee. I'm not seeing people that are like striking me really easily and like my body hurts and it's hot. <laughs> I'm sorry, no raid. I'm also very tired. Oh my gosh, yes, yes. Uh, tomorrow I'm off. You're not gonna see me because it's Wednesday and I am off. So you can catch me Thursday for Pal World, Friday for Baldur's Gate 3 or you know. I'll just see you next time. All right guys. <laughs> the fucking thing not working again. All right, guys, I'll see you. Bye. Bye, 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 bye. Bye.